once again and we are chatting with one of the, if not the best player in D1 men running around from the Southern Penn Sharks, Manny Hendricks. There you go. Uh, hear that clap? Hey, <laughs> mate, you have been fantastic this season. Congratulations, well done. Yeah, the season's been going pretty good. We're starting to get a feel for each other on the court, you know, and starting to really believe and play with confidence. That's a works to get a few wins. Love it. Year. Looking good. Hey, uh, I said to the young man, have you met Kel, by the way? Yeah, yeah we met. Yeah, he's a good yeah. player in, in D1. Yeah. You might come across him at some okay. stage. You might, I oh, know you'll be on the court, but you may come across him. You'll see oh, him okay. in the already Oh, you have? You already played. played. Yeah. Okay, how did he go? How did he go? What was, that, what was that guy? Can you, he can't remember him. Okay. Hey. <laughs> I, I try to forget that game. That's yeah. right. That's right. Yeah. No, 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 no. It was because he had this tough night from the field that night. He forgot. He put it to the back. <laughs> no. Seriously, you couldn't remember it then, could you? <laughs> That's no. right. I love didn't love it. I didn't know. I apologize. <laughs> no, seriously, don't. Don't apologize. <laughs> Do you remember him? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I, I said to the young man not that long ago, I, was, I, I called you Jimi Hendrix. He had no idea. I called you the guitar man. He had no idea. I, I, no idea I get that a lot. Oh, of course you do. Jimi Hendrix was my yeah, uncle, of course my you grandpa. Do. Just anything. So anyway, my next question was, is Jimi Hendrix your grandpa or uncle or anything? <laughs> no, he's not. But, you know, sometimes I might tell people. Us Aussies yeah. wouldn't know, that's yeah. right. So I can say, yeah. <laughs> well, you're from Salt Lake City in yeah. uh, in Utah. It's a it's a wonderful part of America. I'm, I'm going to head into Salt. Uh, I'm going to head into Salt Lake City in uh, the end of this year. So I'm really looking okay. forward to that. It's uh, it is a great place in America. Tell us a little bit about home. Back home, I mean, I grew up there since I was about six. I moved from Dallas to Salt Lake mm -hmm. and grew up. And this it's a nice place. It's a great place to raise your family. Yep. Yep. You no, know, it has a big city life. It has the outskirts to where you know if you want to quiet down. But for the most part, I love it. Mountains. You never seen snow. Yeah. Skiing and snowboarding is the greatest snow on earth. And you got the Utah Jazz, of course. Are you got a Utah, Utah Jazz, Jazz fan? I like the Jazz, but I'm I'm a Laker fan. Oh, I am. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm a, do it I am a Laker oh, fan. Yeah. I, I like James Harden, so I, I would go to Oklahoma City. But yeah. Well, you've got the, the James Harden beers. It's, it's, it's almost there. It's kind of the, the baby stages of it. <laughs> yeah. Work on it. We're getting I'm working on it. So do you like Meta World Peace at the moment? or? Oh, yeah. That was that's a bit of a that was a injury, isn't it? That was a big tough elbow. Wow, that, that was a big elbow. It's yeah. unfortunate that that happened. So hopefully we got Devin Ebanks can step up to the plate. Yeah, he's getting the run. Now you know who I go for? Who? Denver. Oh, yeah, I don't think uh, you have Javale McGee on your team. I, I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> Good on Javel. He's a smart <laughs> guy. Good He's a smart guy. You right? too, Javel. Good call. Yeah, I've got Gallinari. He's a very, very yeah, good player. The Italian rooster. Very, very good, very, very good and, player. Andre Miller went to University of Utah. So yep. I'm definitely yes, he did. Andre Miller. Fan. Yep. Yep. Well, give us a bit of your background over in the states. Your playing career before you landed here in Australia. I went to junior college in uh, Phoenix, Arizona. Mm -hmm. I went to Chandler Gilbert and did a year at Texas Pan American mm -hmm. and then finished off at Indiana Tech. Okay. So I just got done last May. And now I was just kind of waiting to process to play somewhere, and I got a call from Stephen Blackley because mm -hmm. my uncle played over here about 15 years ago. Yep. And so he was looking for players for his team, and so I sent him my film, and they were looking for bigs. So then he said, you know, I, I have potential to play out here, so he forwarded my information to Southern Penn, and he gave me the great opportunity. Wow, fantastic, play. fantastic. I'll tell you what, he's been very, very good. He's feeling it. At the moment on the court, you're getting it done, but um, it looks like uh, off the court, you've got a bit of a school holiday program going on down there, like a lot of the imports do. They get all these clinics going. Tell us a bit about that. Yeah, Sweet definitely. tea, you got these yeah, going. Yeah, the t-shirts made, it just something for the kids that come to the camp. It's just that they can get something when they go home and have something to remember it by. Mm -hmm. yep. You know, on the back of it, it says teamwork, and that's just, in every aspect of life, you need teamwork when you're in the workplace. Sure. Right here, you guys have great teamwork. Oh, on the we couch. Yeah, we, we work on the couch. couch so. I make him look so good. I'm yeah, like Jason just, Kidd. <laughs> I make him look so good. Yeah, definitely. We Jason Kidd and Dirk, like Dirk Nowitzki. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dirk sitting over here. Dirk That's exactly sitting over here. He's got Dirk's hair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. And, and the, lo the local sponsors are definitely helping out with that just to make it a positive environment for the kids yep. in the community. Yeah, it's a great club, the Sharks. They have improved. Uh, sensationally at, at junior level. They uh, recently picked up a, a big award. We had our big state yeah. awards mm. and, and Southern Penn picked one up. 
tell us a little bit about fitting into the club. I gather you're living down around that way. You're near yeah. the water. Do you like the I, beach? I, I've never really seen the water till I got out. Of course, here, yeah. So I definitely go to the water. It's, it's beautiful to look. Yeah, at. yeah. But as far as they really made me feel like I'm at home. Everybody out there is real nice. When I came in, I just went to dinner with so many different families. Mm -hmm. They really like embraced me as one of their own, and I'm I'm very grateful for the opportunity. Fantastic, fantastic. Well, how about the Sharks' uh, chances this year? Like as you said, you did a slow, reasonably slow. Slow, but you know, um, what about that win against Mildura? Wow, wow. wow. <laughs> that only, yeah, that was that, that was, was unbelievable. Tell us about that. Oh, that's that's pretty relevant. Their their atmosphere is, is one of the it's crazy. Oh, they're, they're crazy, crazy up there. They're crazy. I've seen it. it really reminded me of playing back home. Yeah, they are. They're so, lunatics. They're yeah. pitch, pitch we love them though. Yeah. They're all <laughs> they're hot. Fire sticks. Yeah, I definitely I enjoyed it, but it just as a team we're starting to get that confidence to play with each other. Yeah. You know, because in basketball confidence is key. Absolutely. And we went out there and everybody believed that we can get the job done. Because a week prior to that, we played Latrobe, and we we're up at half, mm. and we just kind of let the game slip away from us. So we knew that we had the potential to beat anybody. Yep, yep. And just had to put a full game together. Yep. I think that we're able to do that. As right as here. as big and as loud and as crazy as that crowd is in Mildura, yeah, I reckon they would have been in stunned silence when you guys walked off the court that night. Yeah, I mean. Everybody, the crowd, the first half, they were kind of into it, but we were able to, to silence the crowd for yep. most of the game yep. to where that, that didn't really affect us too much. They can get too much momentum going. And we had some some guys really stepped up for mm. us that night. I mean, Matt Brasser came, absolutely came to play. Great guy. And uh, Tim Shannon, our big. Yeah. Glenn. Uh, Chips and gravy. Chips and gravy yeah. played well. Nathan. Nathan played well also. He's he's kind of our guy that when we need him to guard somebody, he's going to do that. He does all the little stuff that puts our team together. So he definitely had a great game. He matched up with Chris Clark and yep. by the numbers that he's been doing this year. Yeah, down a bit. Yep. Yeah, so we were able to contain him. Jermaine Williams, he, he's efficient. Yeah. Well, not, he yeah. doesn't miss that mid-range. Yeah, no, he's good. He's, <laughs> he's good. He he's, miss, efficient. He's, he's good. Not, yeah, he's efficient, but we're, we're able to sustain the runs yeah. that they had and just come out with a win. So to go on next week to try to keep it going. Manny, you're, um, your goggles. <laughs> uh, there's a there's a trademark now, all right? We're, we're talking about this a bit. Um, okay. But when you get to the charity stripe, yeah. off they come. Yeah, I What's the go? <laughs> and do they fog up? Yeah, they fog up. When, when I stop playing, they fog up a little bit. And so I, I have to just lift them up. And then <laughs> when, I, when I miss a free throw, they're, they're usually on my face. So I have to lift it up and really see the basket. We've got a name for goggles in Australia that fog up. Kel wears them out of the bar all the time. They're called bee goggles. Have you okay. heard of them? I have heard of them. I have heard of them. <laughs> wears them all the time. <laughs> I got to have them all on the court. Hey, up, up in Mildura when you got that win, because we should say that the uh, the Sharks ladies won that night as yeah, well. They yeah, they did. That, 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 that was their first. Win of the season. Yes, that was. So. Uh, well, just a nice, quiet night in Mildura. Did you guys just go back and relax quietly? Uh, yeah, you know, we just went back to the hotel, room, <laughs> ordered some pizzas, and yeah, watch some DVDs. Watch, watch, <laughs> watch, <laughs> watch, <the> <laughs> watch the notebook. Yeah, nice. definitely did. Watch a little TV. Yeah, that was a lot of it. Hey, what do you love about Australia? What, what, what do you like about our great country, man? I really like Nando's. Nando's? <laughs> I really like Nando's. Yeah, that's as Aussie as it comes. Yeah, I wish they had. I wish they had that in the states, but I just like everybody here is nice. Mm. Everybody just embraces <laughs> you here, it, and it's it's a good feeling. It's a good country, isn't it? It is. It's a great, a good it's country. a great country. I didn't know what to expect. I, I had a few ideas, but we're all right. Yeah, we're all everything's we're good. The left side of the road is kind of tough. Yeah, no, I was tough. no you, tough. you guys are a bit backwards over there. You know. Yeah, it's all right. Uh, what about animals? Have you seen any of our furry friends yet? I definitely wanted to see a kangaroo yep. from the time that I got off the plane. Yeah. And so I just asked him about it, and this guy took me on his property. Mm -hmm. And I saw about a hundred of them yeah. running around, and I was jumping up and down, excited, <laughs> recording them. I, I really, I really love seeing the kangaroos. Yeah. And I saw, I haven't seen a koala yet. No, they're trickier. But 
and then they possum. Oh, well, possums and, everywhere. Yeah, yeah, they told me that you know I stay alone, so if I hear something on my yeah. roof, it's a possum. possum. Yeah. So I was asleep the other night, and I just heard something running across my. I thought I thought that was cow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought somebody was coming to try to rob me. I didn't know what. It was, I didn't want to go outside to see what it was, so I just let him run up on my roof. <laughs> Until I fell back asleep, but I couldn't go to sleep for about an hour and a half because I didn't know what it was. Can you believe? Can you believe on our on our Australian coat of arms? Oh, like you guys have got, you know, the the bald eagle. Man. Well, the bald eagle, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Can you believe on our coat of arms we, we've got a, a kangaroo and we've got an emu? Have you heard of an emu? Uh, it's, like an it's like an ostrich. Yeah, like an ostrich. No, nope, it's a big, big Australian bird, like an ostrich. So we've, we've got a kangaroo and an ostrich uh, and, a, and an emu. Do you know that we eat those? We eat those animals. You go down to the supermarket and you can buy some kangaroo mm -hmm. and some really? emu. Yeah. Did you know that? No, I did. Do you eat bald eagles back at home or? No. Nope, what if you're really go. hungry? No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> they're, 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 they're flying too high. We can't quite get to them. So you got you definitely you definitely got us beating that category. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I just feel like we can do this. I oh, know. Oh, could we? Yeah. Hey, on the easy. couch. On the couch, we normally go <laughs> for about I don't know six minutes. Yeah. I reckon we're about ten in, man. We can keep going another. Ten, I reckon. Yeah, Manny definitely. Hendricks has been a star. It's Absolute it star. What about the competition? Um, what do you think of our great competition, the Big V? I think that it's it's good competition out here. It was it was, took me a little bit to get used to, but I, you guys are a lot physical out here. Everybody plays physical. Some of us, most of us, yeah, well, not all most of us. us, for the most part. And uh, he's a member, so you guys, <laughs> yeah, you guys, you guys they shoot the ball out here yep. extremely well. Yeah, okay. yep. yeah. There's a couple of Aussies uh, over in America doing very, very good things. A lot of college, Matty Della Padova is doing great things at St. Mary's, but uh, Paddy Mills yeah. is uh, with San Antonio now. He's, he's, a, he's a good thing. Andrew Bogut in recent times as well. And yeah, Utah boy, yeah, he was Andrew absolutely. Bogut is a Utah yeah. boy. Absolutely. What, uh, what do you think about our Aussies over in the States? I think that they're coming over. We have a player on our team that's headed over to the States to play basketball. Yeah. And Patty Mills is a great player. I saw him playing in college on TV. Mm -hmm. Andrew Bogut, uh, my dad works at the University of Utah, yeah. so yeah. I was always at his games. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I just think that, you know, people coming from another country to make an impact like that just makes basketball mm -hmm. better. Just B Back at home, uh, when, when you talk about Australia, in America, okay. Because some people, some people in America think Australia is just south of Mexico. You know, yeah. Somewhere down <laughs> south yeah. America. Well, what, what, what do people think of Australia? What, what, what are the conversations Crocodile about? Crocodile Dundee. Crocodile Dundee. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I thought that kangaroos were in everyone's backyard. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's pretty I standard. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, definitely we get thought that. kangaroos were everywhere. We get that, yep. And then uh, yeah. the movie is, I think it's Wolf Creek. Oh, Wolf Creek. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I, I, when, I, yeah. when I first came out here, yeah, I had no, Wolf have... Creek, have you ever heard of Horsham? No. Oh, okay, go on. I had, to ask, <laughs> I had to ask somebody where Wolf Creek was, and I, yeah. hopefully it wasn't close to where you were. Nah, just north of the ocean. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. so, but that was, <laughs> those, were the, those were the few things that, that I knew that the um, Australian Open, you know, yeah, I, like, yeah. I like yeah. golf, I like tennis. Aussie rules. Aussie rules. Have you seen the Aussie rules yet? I haven't. Have you picked a team? Sydney, you go for Sydney or? Oh. I saw a netball. I never heard of netball before I got out here. Yeah, don't worry about it. Sorry, man. Netball. It's not good. It's just footy. Man. Footy. 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 I, I am definitely a footy who, fan. Who? Which team? I only been to one game. Yeah, who did yeah. you go see? Hawthorne versus Geelong. Yeah. Or did you go, yeah, which one did game. you go for? Good game. I was going for Hawthorne. Yeah. I was going for Hawthorne. And we won. And Geelong won. <laughs> That's we just, who I go for. But, but the fourth quarter, we just kind of... Choked. Choked. Yeah, yeah, choked. We choked. We choked. Do you understand that 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 guy that stands down in between the big sticks and he? Yeah, does I, that? I do you this get? all the time. No, I don't. But every time he does this, and I just. <laughs> hey, you know so what we want to see? It's weird. You know what we want to see? Now, we're, hey, hey, the big V crew, the, yeah. the big V TV crew. This is what we're going to put on you. All right. What we want to see is we want to see it become a trademark of yours this season, right? Okay. When you score a, re you have to do it every basket. <laughs> oh, yeah. But when you score a really big basket. Ask it in the game. We want to see you do this. I definitely will. All right. That's what we want to see. If you're so is it one, one hand sometimes? Don't they you do can, one? No, nah, you one. just go the two, man. It's a yes. good every time for you. You just go the two. Right. When yeah. you when I'm you there. score a really big basket, we want <laughs> okay. to see that Manny Hendricks. Bang. Okay, I think the next time I get a slam dunk. <laughs>
this. How many slam dunks you had this season? Always up few. Uh, I'm not sure. A few. Nice. Few. I'll tell you what, this has been one of the best on the couch. I've had a great time. He's a Easy. superstar. He's Jimi Hendrix's late great great nephew. Oh, <laughs> uh, Grant. Yeah. Oh, Grant. Fantastic. The start of my life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All the way out of Salt Lake City. Yeah. Uh, Southern Penn has got a superstar this season. There's yeah. no doubt about it. We love your work, mate. Manny Hendrix, well done. Thank and uh, it's been a pleasure having you on the couch, man. Right? Thank you. Good work. Well done. All right. See you what later. a star. <laughs> what a star. That's great. Well done, mate. All right. <laughs> I'm over the side of my sofa